Okay, family, here we are. Hey, what is the name of your uh, your lumber yard? What? Your, what's the name? For me? Yeah. Suleiman. Suleiman, this yes. is your yard? Yes. Okay, all right. What's the name? Suleiman Kante. All right, Suleiman yes. Tete. We're here and down by, uh, uh, it's this, um, Kusuta. What is, what is it? Kusuta. 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 And it's right by, um, the, uh, the Jabon traffic, the Jabon highway. Jabon highway. Okay, guys, we're here getting lumber. All right. And we're going to be getting some lumber. Here's our, our drivers. He's going to be transporting for us. So if you need some lumber, guys, here you go. This is where we're going to get ours at the yard right here. And there's Terry. Say hi, Arrival family. Hello, Arrival family. I hope yes. everyone is well. Sitting here waiting for the, um, the wood. Yeah. And you know in Gambia you have to be patient because yes. everything is a... Um, Oh, wait. It's not a rush rush. A little wait. Yeah. <laughs> so as you can see, this is where one of the lumber yards that they have here where we get our lumber from. And this is red lumber. This stuff is like, I think it's like mahogany or something. But it's really strong. But this is some nice lumber. Really good. Let me just walk out here. Let me show you some of the, one of the doors they made. This door is nice. Here you go. Now, see, this is where I got. I came to this right here and got some pieces. They were throwing these away, and that's a lot of good lumber that you can kind of work with if you have the tools and cutting them up and everything. So I made those benches and everything out before earlier when we first got here a few years back. But that's what this is the type of lumber I use to make that uh, furniture a little bit. So, but here we have some nice doors very nice doors that they have that they're handmade and these are solid doors solid doors and as you can see they're putting the lumber on top of the taxi to transport it yeah and that's going to be how we're going to get it there so i'll be coming back at you and like i said we're here at um uh, i forgot the name he said but we're on the highway if you're looking for some lumber and here we are, right here, guys. It's a uh, Sakuda Highway. All right, guys, so that's it. This is the lumber, and I'll pick it back up when we get there. All right. Okay, guys, here's the face board we're gonna be putting up. And hopefully we'll show you the final product. Some nice wood right there. I tell you, man, this wood here in Gambia is beautiful. Okay guys, here we go. We got back at the compound. We got the material here and it's a ride. Driver dropped it off. Here's everything we're gonna need to put on this roof. We have two by threes, two by twos, facial board, one by six, galvanized to tie down the roof, and of course, pork it. And there's the man making it, Mr. Bubakar. And Mohammed up there, working away, so they're working on the roof. There you go, working that skill car. So, just wanted to show you we started. I'll come back with the progress. And talk to you later, guys. Hey, guys. Okay. Uh, the guys finished for the day. And, um... This is how far they got. They got all the, got a lot of the wood up. It's um a lot more to be done, you know. Masoner has to come in and put the holes in and have to secure everything. Uh, make sure everything is where we want it to be level. But um, pretty much, this is what we've had done today. You know, and this is a temporary pole here. These poles are temporary because I'm going to put up. We're going to run this straight across and make it kind of look uniform. So it's coming together. All right. Oh, and I don't know. Did I show you the belt? There's the belt. The belt is done. Yeah. All right. And that's, what it, that's how it came out. The lintels over top of the windows. All right. I think I'll go up and get a view from up top. Okay, hold on. Okay, here's the view from up top. 
you can see how it looks. Still have a lot of work to be done. But for the most part, it's coming out pretty good. You know? Guys seem to be doing a pretty good job. All right, I'll keep you posted on how things come out and how it turns out. Give you an update on our next video. All right, have a good day. Hey guys, they got the cord get on and uh, the facial board and everything's trying to come together. We're gonna close all that. Next step is to close all of that in and secure that up there. So this is what, this is how they do a corrugate roof. You know, we got the slab roof and then the corrugate roof. So the one that I'm about to walk up on is a slab roof. Now this is the wooden corrugate. And so I might run a soffit underneath this over. So I'll close all that in. And as you can see, it's nice and tight. Everything looks really good. You see, so we're moving right along, guys. And so I'm gonna walk up here so you can get a top view of how it looks. All right. So you can see, guys did a really good job today. They were working hard. So there's the roof from the top view. Now they have different types of uh, roof material. They have something called a Dakar. It's like, almost like the size of uh, shingles back in the States. But they're little slats that they use. And these are actually corrugate, eight feet long corrugate that they put together. And they nailed them nice and neat. So everything was done really nice. But if you're doing a corrugate roof, just make sure you get the real most um, durable corrugate that you can find. They got some real light flimsy stuff and they have some real good durable stuff. But like I stated, everything looks good and now that we got the roof, we can move on to securing the sides of it and everything and closing it in and make sure everything is watertight and then move on to the inside. All right, so we'll keep you posted. Thanks guys.